So he's moving. He's actually. Oh, okay. What's up, guys? We got D here, and welcome back to the Crooked Man. Let's do a little recap. David got a crazy mom. Check. So our house is haunted, technically. Either it's haunted or we got a homeless man living in our walls. <laughs> but what does it all mean? I have no idea. But that's enough talking. Let's get into it. Whoa. Hello? Oh! No, no, I'm not going that way. Staff only. There's wide around the door. Just walking around. Is this the kitchen? Bro, why are we even here, David? Oh, okay. What's this? The door is locked. There is a notice on the door. Due to employee incompetence and lost keys, the library is temporarily closed. We apologize for the inconvenience, I guess. So this place is open. But it looks so fancy to even look abandoned. But maybe that's just me. It is really quiet, did it? <laughs> that got me low-key. Locked. Locked, locked, locked. All of these are locked, dude. What's the staff only? It locks with a code. Locked, locked. Oh! What the fuck? Look around like this. Something on the shelf. Treasure hunt. Me, dear mom and dad. Treasure hunt? Ha, I guess, sure. Haha, <laughs> I guess I'll look for your treasure. That's a lot of boxes. Like those blue squares. What if that's the room with a lot of chairs in it? It wouldn't hurt to look. Alright, for now on, I'm gonna just not skip any doors. Cause what if a door magically opens? I would never know. I'm checking every one of these chairs. I do not care. <laughs> to say yeah i'm looking at the tables and the tables remind me of the drawing so it has to be in here okay cool something's under the table gold key it worked this is the library yeah oh what's over here a key got the key to 108 what's this book over here pie of the unseen do you consider yourself kind you don't get to decide that it's decided in the unconscious even if you believe you are cold-hearted you may be warm and emotional inside and they will sniff it out they will be lured by your unconscious kindness and they will drag you away some kind of cult book i bet paul would have loved this he's way into that stuff it's quiet it's quiet i did not jump i don't care is someone here? Let's go to 108. Let's go to 108. That's where we're supposed to go. There's something on top. Got wire cutters. Oh, for the door. I know where to go. I know where to go. Let's go. I know where. I, I'm not about to do this. I'm sorry. I, I just came in and the piano looks nice. So I uh, sorry I yelled at you I'm not on the staff for the hotel or anything. Who are you then? I'm David. I'm sort of looking for a guy. What about you? I'm sissy. Well, nice to meet you sissy. What brings you here? It could be dangerous, you know I stay at this hotel once, but I forgot something important. So I came back to get it. I see. Did you find it? No, I'm still looking It's just like it's just this little box decorated with rubies, but I'm not leaving until I find it I'll probably be here a while longer so I can help you find it model citizen <laughs> We don't have to help her, but you know why not David's a good guy. Really? That would be great. Okay, please help Just do me a favor too though. If you see a man about my age, would you tell me? Okay? What am I doing shouting at girls? I feel like the shady one here. I guess he was trying to sneak up on her, but I mean, I thought, I low key thought it was a ghost. I did not expect the person to actually be here with us, but we got wire cutters now, so I know where to go. I know where to go. Mm -hmm. Cut that. Uh, this is technically invading, but you know what? Let's go in. Whoa, a notebook. Door in room 106, bathroom needs fixing. Got key to 106. I know where to go. But before we go, let's check around. Full of malicious goods. What's this door? There's no doorknob. Uh, <laughs> somebody locked in there? I should find some way to open it. No, we don't. The doorknob is off of it for a reason. Right here. Pretty sure this is a hotel, so all the rooms will look the same. Oh yeah, this is the bathroom that needs fixing. A doorknob. Oh yeah, that journal mentioned something about door repairs. Would it work on that door without a knob? I'll give it a shot. All I'm saying is, if that guy is not in there when we open the door, we need to leave. <laughs> He's not in here. Where is he? Like, seriously. I, I thought I was being a hero, but where is he? Is he down here? A small drawer which won't open. It doesn't seem to have a lock. It doesn't seem to have a lock, but it's it won't open. That looks weird. This looks weird. This towel seems a little loose. Wait, what? Why would I not do nothing? Stomp on it. I stomped on it. Was that like a... Did this open this? Ah! It opened! There's a ladder and it goes down. 
Where else? Maybe I should check this out. Okay, David, whatever, dude. Do we have like a flashlight? We have a lighter. I remember that. We do have a lighter. Okay. Ah, ah this is this is gross, dude. Why is this even a thing? Is that oil? Whoa. What? Are you okay? Hey, were you locked? Is that what? What are you? I don't see nobody. Were you locked in here? That's that's a person. <laughs> what the? Huh? What? Are you okay? What is it? He sounds like he's eating something and... Oh! What the fuck? Right. Whoa! Right. Oh, let me go. Zeta, shit! Are you dead ass? What the His neck! Was he eating? I was about to say was he eating sissy, but we would have heard a scream or something. I must be seeing things. I'm so tired. I feel sick. <laughs> yeah, I wonder what sissy up to. Did she find what she came for? If he... Bro, what? Survivor first encounter with the crooked man? Bro, I need to turn off steam notifications. This is... This is ass. I don't like that. Where can sissy even be at? Can we leave? I'll look around here a little more. Of course, yeah, after we just almost got eaten by the crooked man. But, you know, hey, it's fine, I guess. I got this... Ah! That was loud! Whoa, that was loud. That actually got me. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. What happened, sissy? I went I went to a window and the floor gave in. What should I do? Yeah, uh, sissy, jump over. It's dangerous. Man, can you possibly jump that far? I got this big. There's no time for pessimism. It's going to crumble soon. Hurry, I'll catch you. Yeah! We're like a bigger brother. This, this is pretty, this is pretty wholesome. No, no. I don't like the door. I don't like the door! Alright. <clears throat> it's okay, sissy. I'm here. I'm sorry, I know you were scared, but it's fine now. Did you find what you was looking for? No, not yet. It wasn't in a room we stayed in. It must be really important if you came out here by yourself. You can always just give up on it, if that's what you want. It's not entirely safe here. I can't give up on it. I have to find it. It's a present for my boyfriend. It's the most important thing to me. After my own life. What? You're looking for someone, right? I haven't met anyone yet, but can you tell me more about them? Ah, uh, <laughs> I don't know that much either. Just that he's a man about my age. You know that little about the person you're looking for? You're a strange guy, David. Yes, yes he is. I would have been hurt badly if he wasn't here. I'm really grateful to you for saving you. Saving me. Oh my gosh. I should get going. Take care, David. I'll see you around. Later. Man, eh, he's looking for something for our boyfriend, so right. at least we could do his helper. But damn, this is one big ass gash. Dude. That's a scrap from a notebook on the dresser. It was our special place. She loved the pretty room with its big mirror. She would wonder what to wear for dinner. But now it's just me. I thought it might help to come here, but it didn't. There's only emptiness. Okay. Roll on this page. It matches the one from my room. So the former tenant did come here. I wonder if he's still here. I don't think he's in here, dude. We like literally are opening doors from Doors that we're not even supposed to be allowed in, but I mean, hey, we the only thing we can do is keep looking. Packed tight with books from G to H, I to J, K to L. That's very specific. I like how every time we see Sissy, she literally just disappears. Like we can't even find her. That might be the last time we seen her. For a second, I thought the Cookie Man was eating her. He was eating something. I don't think we should go back in there. Yeah, I don't think we should go. Back in there. What if she's in there, Sissy? The basement door open. I was joking when I said she might be down here. She wouldn't go down here, right? Right? He's going. But how is it open? There's something here. Bronze key. Bronze key. What do I need to open with a bronze key? Maybe I am going crazy. What if David actually is going crazy? That'd be weird. That'd be interesting. It might be for this. Mm hmm There we go. This is a bar. A journal seemingly written by a staff member. A toast to our owners, who left his employees and fled into the night. We'll drink all the beer we got. Hell, it's the only good thing we have here. Being out of a job is no good, but at least we don't have to see his mug no more. We were so sick of that in Egghead, always trying to flaunt his intelligence. Installing weird stuff with a basement door, having a number lock on the food storage, 
All his silly crap made the place impossible to run. Plus, the passcode was this thing with a book, which he changed up every month. What the hell do you do if you forget? Maybe it's good for him, but sure as hell not us. Ah, whatever. Once we're done with this booze, we're out of here. A toast to our bright futures. Passcode on food is pretty absurd. Yeah, that is crazy. What if the tenant is the guy they're talking about? The book of the month. Maybe we might have to go back to the library because the library is specifically in alpha, it's in it's in alphabetical order. So maybe look in the look in the T area. <sighs> the blackboard in the owner's room said the strange case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. It will be on the shelf, right? And that will have a number probably in this book. Something indeed, which I'm not reading this. Holy shit! I did not mean to. Chapter two. Search for Mr. Hyde. Chapter 4, a rare murder case. Chapter 5, incident of the leg. Chapter 8, the last night. Chapter 10, Henry General, full statement of the case. Was I supposed to read everything? Shit! There's a clue in here. Just read it. Just read all of it. Just, just give me a minute. It's skipping numbers. Ah, uh, this is funny. This is, this is fun. It skipped three. Four, five, six, seven. Three, six, seven, nine. Three, six, seven, nine. Three, six, seven, nine. Is that the code? I'm gonna feel like a genius if I'm actually right, but. What? That monster! It's out! It's okay, I can, I can, I can, I, I, uh, uh, uh. It's coming this way. Crap, I gotta escape. What? I did not move! I did not move! Don't tell me I gotta start over! I'm at the fuck! Let, let's save. It's fine. Alright, we're back. That didn't take that much. We're back. Ooh, the crooked man! The crooked man! <laughs> It's coming, I gotta escape. See, David moved. See, this motherfucker's following me. Oh shit, he's actually... Oh, okay. <laughs> what the fuck? Good thing we saved. Good thing we saved. This game knew I was gonna book it, so just jump. Maybe if I drop him down here. What do you mean, drop him? I'm not moving. <laughs> okay, David! I didn't expect him to push him. What is that monster? <laughs> I should warn Sissy when I see her. I knew it would be dangerous for her. What if the crooked man already got to her? That'd be kind of dark, but I doubt it. Sissy's best girl. N no, that doesn't even make sense. I Wait, how old is Sissy? Oh shit. Seven, nine. <laughs> Come on, bro. It's too easy. <laughs> I'm sorry. Anybody could have figured that puzzle out. I'm sorry. Just let me be happy. We don't gotta worry about the crooked man for a while. He's gone. God damn, two on that. Alright, I can blame it. But the crooked man did escape from that one thing he was in. So him escaping from that big fall. Oh, it's not out the realm of possibilities, but you know. Ow, whoa, 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 whoa. That's safe. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I, I just I'm not getting caught lacking ever again. It's like something was badly burnt. Was this a photo? There's something under the pieces. Found a scrap from a notebook. I don't need her anymore. Wait, <laughs> I don't need her memory anymore because I know she won't come back. I have to erase everything, good and bad, and all the memories inside me too. Damn, how? <sighs> My head. David? It's easing up. Jeez, I'm exhausted. I guess I haven't slept much. So he burnt this photo to mend his broken heart, huh? I knew I couldn't do that. I'll never forget. Never. According to Paul. That makes me a pansy. He's relating to the guy, probably with Shirley. Oh, sissy. Did you find the box? No, I can't find it. There are a lot of rooms I can't get into, so it might be in one of those. What's wrong, David? You look kind of pale. Uh, it's nothing. But sissy, you should really leave soon. Why? You may not believe me, but there's some kind of bizarre monster around. I found it in the basement. In the base. I found it in the basement. I was attacked by it earlier, but you'll definitely be in danger too. So I think you should go. Look, I don't like dark, scary places either, but there's no need to tease me like that. I'm not a kid afraid of the bookie man, okay? I that was okay, sorry. You don't seem like a dishonest guy. So I like to believe you, but a monster? Be safe, but I did push him though. I think she should be good though.
That's the bar. I see blood. I see red. I see red. Red whiting. <laughs> red whiting. <laughs> I said red white. Leave me alone. Please leave me alone. Seems pretty inconsistent. Who could have wrote this? Oh no! Are you serious? I dropped you down the pit! I don't know where to go. Crap, I gotta do something. Yeah, I'm done after this. I'm done after this. And I gotta go through this entire... Oh my god. I'm done getting caught lacking. I'm saving every chance I get. Like, he legit flashed that towards me. I'm probably... I don't know. I'm gonna have to do something. Because right when he went in that hall, he just... He has a speed boost. What? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I just... Oh, I grabbed the bottle. Batter out. <laughs> god damn it. Oh, I guess that won't do much else. What else can I do? Oh, shit. Shit! Oh my gosh. I see the other bottles. Do I grab those too? <laughs> he ate that, dude. <laughs> Fuck you! Alright, uh, it's like my fifth time, sixth time. It, I literally just got an achievement from dying from this dude like six times. Like, this is getting out of hand. Let's just, um. <laughs> He eats that, dude. Okay, running is out the question. This is stupid. <laughs> I'm about to quit. Look out! I'm dead. Alright, y'all. See you on the see you on the next video. Bye.